Shall we continue here? <clears throat> Get these last precepts. Um, we're in better. So now we can go back to um, at, we can get our stream nineteen. Sharp, that's beautiful in here, boy. All right, so you get the book of Acts three nineteen. Acts three and nineteen. Yeah. Repent, de repent ye therefore and be converted, that your sins may be blotted out. And when the times of refreshing shall come from the the presence of the Lord. Right. And he shall sink. Yahweh shall which before was preached unto you. Right. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go Whom ahead. the heavens must receive until the times of restitution. Until the times of restitution and okay, of all you, things right. which God have spoken by the mouth of all his prophets right. since the word began. The Lord said, the Lord said, uh, the Lord said he come to fulfill that that was written, which was written, is that it? Go ahead. For Moses truly said unto the fathers, a prophet shall come, no, a, prophet, a, a prophet shall the Lord your God raise up unto you right. of your brethren, like unto me. Him shall hear him, him shall ye hear in all things. Right. Whatsoever he shall say unto you, right. and it shall come to pass that every soul which will not hear the, that prophet shall be destroyed from among you, from, from among the people. Right, God, you see that? So that's the point. The point is to repent. You are saying, Lord, true men out there, tell you to repent. You say, and if you don't listen to the Lord's men, you're going to be destroyed along with Esau Edom. Right? So they say, Though hand, John, and hand of wicked shall not go and punish. You say, so we tell you to repent. Right? Verse 25 Ye are the children of the prophets and of the covenant which Moses made with our fathers, saying unto Abraham, and in thy seed shall all the kindreds of the earth. Be blessed. You say? Um, unto you first, the Messiah having raised up his son, Yahweh Shai, sent him to bless you and turn it away, every one of you, from his iniquities. And that includes idols as well. You say? Going by the Exodus 20. Thou shalt have no other gods before me, but you worship Buddha, Serapis Christus, Caesar Borgia, which is Caesar Borgia. You know what I mean? Selassie, Hindu God, Shiva, all those are the ways of the Gentiles, man. That is not the, the true and living power, man. You see? Right. It's good it says, um, Luke 1. See, Luke 1. And 68. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. You see? Right. The Lord God of Israel, man. For he have visited and redeemed his people. Who's the Lord's people? You got Amos 3 and 1. Deuteronomy 7 and 6. Deuteronomy 14 and 2. You know what I'm saying? Joel 2 27. Isaiah 4 and 17. Isaiah 4 eh, Israel shall be saved in the Lord. You see? And have raised up an horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David. As he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets which have been since the world began. That we should be saved from our enemies, cause contrary to popular belief, we have enemies. That's why when the gang shoot them in the streets all the time, the food is designed to destroy you. The Planned Parenthood, you understand? The vaccine trial is always happening in the, the, the western part of Africa. You understand? You the last had the first fired. You're mocking stock. Don't care if you're a, a LeBron James or if you're a, a, a um, a Virgo on the streets. It is the city that men call the perfection of beauty. Is that? That we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all that hate us. To perform the mercy promised to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant, the oath which he swore to our father Abraham, 
that he would grant unto us that we being delivered over the hand of our enemies might serve him without fear in holiness and righteousness before him all the days of our life. Yeah, B. So that we desire, but that we really, 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 really desire to do, serve the Lord wholeheartedly. You know what I mean? So, um, hey, um, whoa, oh, verse 77 to give knowledge of salvation unto his people, <laughs> the children of Israel. The knowledge of salvation is to his people by the remission of their sins to the tender mercy of our power whereby the dear spring from on high have visited us to give light to them that sit in darkness and in the shadow of death to guide our feet into the way of peace so we in the valley of the shadow of death right now and our only light is this truth and this knowledge you understand the darkness that we once had being in the world let me get our last preset, right? That's in Peter. We will escape the pollutions of the world. That's in the book of Peter. That's the first. Uh, first, no, second Peter 2 and 20. For if after they have escaped the pollutions of the world through the knowledge of of the Lord and Savior Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, they are again entangled therein and overcome. The latter end is worse with them than the beginning. So we escape to the to this word, to this truth. But if you fall out, the latter end is going to be worse than the beginning. So it can be worse off than when you even started. Me that we lost to give diligence to make a call and be less sure. For if you do these things, you shall never fail. Right? Go in there? Hmm? Go in there? Okay, read 2 Samuel 22 and 3. Read it. All right, go ahead. The God of my rock, in him will I trust. He is my shield and the horn of my salvation. My high, pop, my high tower and my refuge, my savior. Thou savest me from violence. Go on. I, I can read verse 4. I will call on the Lord who is worthy to be praised. So shall I be saved from my enemies. When the waves of death come past me, the floods of ungodly men made me afraid. The sorrows of hell come past me about. The snares of death prevented me. In my distress, I call upon the Lord. I cry to my power. And he did hear. And he did hear my cry. You know why? Because we doing his will. I read earlier, the, the, um, you turn your ears from hearing the law, your prayer will be an abomination. The Lord said, he, would, he says what? In my distress, I call upon the Lord and cry to my power. And he did hear my voice out of his temple, and my cry did enter into his ears. Then the earth shook and trembled. The foundations of heaven moved and shook because he was wroth. So the Lord can hear all prayers when we cry unto him because we are doing his will you see we didn't turn our backs man we, we face the lord we 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 acknowledge our sins and we um the lord say he's near to them that are of a broken and contrite spirit you see they went up a smoke out of his nostrils and fire out of his mouth devoured coals were kindled by it he bowed the heavens also and came down, and darkness was under his feet. And he rode upon the cherub, that's a chariot, a huge UFO, you know what I mean? And he rode upon the cherub and did fly, and he was seen upon the wings of the wind. And he made darkness pavilions round about him, dark waters and thick clouds of the skies. They the Lord could do some wonderful things in this modern day time. You see? Right? <coughs> The Lord thundered from heaven, and the Mosai uttered his voice, and he sent out arrows and scattered them, lightning and discomforted them, and the channels of the sea appeared. The foundations of the world were discovered at the rebuke of the Lord, at the blast of the breath of his nostrils. So, hey, the Lord is going to do wonderful works for his men. You know what I mean? Because we call upon him. 
And he's gonna say, let me get our last preset, Zachariah 13. Yeah, to end it, right? Zachariah 13, he, he will say, it is my people, man. Cause we doing his will. Zachariah 13 and 8. And it shall come to pass that in all the land save the Lord, two parts therein shall be cut off and die. But the third shall be left therein. And I will bring the third part through the fire. And we will refine them as silver is refined. And we will try them as gold is tried. They shall call on my name. And they will hear them. I will say it is my people. And they shall say the Lord is my power. So, hey, so you love to hear our Christ, boy. You say, you love to hear our Christ. And he will say what? It is my people. You know what I mean? No anything else? No anything else? I'm going to read Psalms 102. The prayer of the afflicted. When he is overwhelmed and poured out his complaint before the Lord. Hear my prayer, O Lord. Let my cry come unto thee. Hide not thy face from me in the day when I am in trouble. Incline thy ear unto me in the day when I call. Answer me speedily, for my days are consoled like smoke, and my bones are burned as as the heart of as in hearth. Hearth. Yeah. My heart is smitten and withered like grass, so that I forget to eat my bread. Yeah, because we get a lot of stress, man, in this place, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> so that your heart is your mind. You see? Like, well, man. By reason of the voice of my groaning, my bones cleave to my skin. Yeah, man, you're pissed off, man. You're complaining about everything, man, you know what I mean? I am like a pelican of the wilderness. I am like an owl of the desert. I watch, and I am as a sparrow alone upon the roof. How stop? That how his feet sometimes, boy. You know, his feet alone sometimes, boy. You know what I mean? Say, you're watching by yourself. But any my enemies reports me all day, and there that, and there that are mad against me are sworn against me, mm. for I have eaten ash like bread and mingled my drink like weeping. Because of thy indignation, thy wrath, for thou hast lifted me up and cast me down. Mm. For my days are like a shadow that declineth, and I am withered like grass. But mm. thou, O Lord, shalt endure forever, and thy remembrance to all generations God. that shall rise and have mercy upon thou, thou, shall, thou shall rise. rise. Right. And have mercy upon Zion right. for the Jeez. time to favor her. Yeah. yeah. Set time is come. Yeah, so the time to favor her and the set time is come. You see? Right. For the servants take pleasure in her stones and favor and favor the dust thereof. Yeah, that's the different stones in the earth. You see? Right. You know what I mean? His resources right. so the heathen shall fear the name of the Lord mm. and all the kings of the earth thy glory mm. and when the Lord shall build up Zion he shall appear in his glory mm. he shall regard the prayer of destitute mm. and despise their prayer he will regard the prayer of the destitute he will re he regard the prayer of the destitute right. and and not, not dis despise their prayer see that's plain you see go ahead, go ahead. This shall not be written. No, this shall be written. This shall be written for the generation to come. God. And the people which shall be created shall praise the Lord. God. Yeah. Yeah. For he have looked down from the heights of his sanctuary from heaven. Did the Lord behold the earth mm. to hear the groaning of the prisoner, to loose those that are appointed to death. That's us, man. You say, go ahead. To declare the name of the Lord in Zion, in Zion man. and the praise in Jerusalem. God. When the people are gathered together and the kingdoms to serve the Lord, mm. he he weakened he weakened my strength in the way. He shortened my day. Mm. I said, Oh my God, take me not away in the midst of my day. The years are taught are throughout. throughout all generations mm. of all has thou laid the foundation of the earth and the heavens are the works of thy hands they shall perish mm. thou shall 
endure. Yeah, all of them shall wax all its garments. As a vesture shall thou change them, and they shall be changed. But thou art the same, and thy years shall, shall have no end. The children of thy servant shall continue, and their siege shall be established before thee. Yeah. Yeah, boy, so hey, that's beautiful, boy, you know what I mean? So you can go end it there, you know what I mean? Is that it? Until next time, all praises to Yahweh, Bashim Yahushai, Bashim Makaka Dash, Shalom.